crazy borgies. I'm so not used to being in front of a camera at all, so you'll have to bear with me. I thought I'd hop on, show you my face, because a few of the YouTube sisters have done so, so I thought, why not? As scary as it is, and trust me, it's scary, because it's so hot here in the UK. It is, oh. Oh, it's really hot today and in fact I'm just about to take my children swimming this evening I'm gonna go at seven o'clock in the evening because that's the best time of day um, it's the quietest and yeah so I wanted to do this unboxing because it's a new to me company and I've seen Sweet Tea unbox them as well it's not anything craft related and um, I hope you enjoy the video so let's get started okay so firstly you'll ha I'll have to apologize for it being a bit red in the living room I have drawn all my curtains um, to keep the Sun out basically so I hope that the lighting is okay ish okay I've just turned on my my light for you so this company reached out to me and I have seen Sweet Tea as I said do an unboxing for them I'm going to try and say this name of this company but you know I'll probably get it wrong it's Whisk that's as good as it's going to get coming from my mouth I'm telling you because <laughs> I'm not good at pronunciations okay um, so they reached out to me asking me if I would like to review some of their products of course I said yes it's not craft related but of course my channel is craft related and my life related basically so it's a handy product everyone always needs one so I thought why not um, before I start my unboxing if I could first and foremost say if you like my content then please give me a thumbs up subscribe like comment and share all that lovely youtube -y stuff that we asked you to do and also follow me on tiktok and instagram on crazy borgies diamond art okay so and i'm firstly going to apologize for the state of these because i have been stitching and i've really hurt my fingers guys doing too much cross stitch i tell you it should come with a health warning <laughs> no, i'm only joking it just but I have really hurt my finger and I've had to invest in some finger protectors for them so anyway right so I have got one two three four products to show you today I've got my tape measure handy as well and you can probably guess what they are just by me showing you these so They are little tote bags. Well, they're not little, actually. They're quite big, nice sizes. Actually, I'm going to have to zoom. There we go. So, I've zoomed you out. So, you can see the full pattern. So, this one came with, you could either have it black with a light L there. And L is obviously for my name, Louise. Or you could have it white with black and because of where I'm always going here there and everywhere with my kids I'm going to use one of these to take my kids swimming stuff with me all the towels and all that the floats so that's why I wanted to unbox today before I use them and then I can let you know how they measure up so right let me give you a quick right so the size of it is it's 40, 40 and a half centimetres wide by, by 40. So let's just say it's 40 by 40. So that's a really good size. It's enough for you to be able to get your beach towel in, your swimsuits in, your lunch in, whatever, your purse. The only thing is they don't have a zip, which is okay. So I wouldn't put anything to um too valuable in there because they don't they don't have a close bit there a button or anything i'm just seeing if there's any washing instructions on the bag because it feels like a cottony heavy 
cottony sort of material they are tote bags um, I'm wondering if you could perhaps put it in the washing machine maybe um, maybe on a cold wash though or hand wash it so one thing I would say to Wisp if you're watching is please put in some washing instructions so we know how to take, make the most of our products, make them last the longest, etc. Because me personally, I will be using these in everyday life for going out and about. And there's no precise instruction to say how to wash them. Just seeing. So that would have been handy. But anyway, I'm presuming I will give it a try on a low, on a low um, heat wash and see how it measures up and I'll let you know about that hopefully the colours won't run but I just thought this was a really beautiful pattern and I'm always looking for bags guys to work, to carry stuff in because obviously my child one of my children is severely autistic and whenever I go anywhere with her I've got to carry lots of stuff with me I'm talking nappies, wet wipes still, bottles, you know, food whatever I can grab basically and you know it is extremely difficult I don't want to be going out with hundreds of bags so to get a big bag like this it's perfect for me to just throw in a few nappies throw in a few wet wipes and off I go with some food or whatever so I will most definitely they will be getting used a lot let me tell you so I was, I'm really pleased with these actually. And they're all lined, they're all stitched inside as well. Sorry, they're not lined, I never meant lined. They're stitched, but it does look like that heavy duty stuff, you know, that tote bags are made from. And the handles seem quite solid as well. They're not gonna fall off anytime soon. So yeah, I'm really pleased with this one, really pleased. So there's this one, and I can, as I said, I'm going to link all these products, all these bags I'm, I'm going to show you today, I'm going to link them in the description box down below, and then you can just simply go into the description box and click on the link and it will take you straight through to Wisp's website. I, I'm going to stop saying the name of the company now because I'm not good at pronunciations at all. Okay, so my next one is of... <laughs> I bet you can't guess why I got this one, guys. Yes, it's of a Rotti, a Rottweiler. As most of you know, who have been with my channel a long time, I have a Rottweiler called Princess. And, well, actually, her full name is Princess Diamond, okay? Um, but I call her Pringle most of the time, or Pring Pring, or AKA Come Here, or What's Your Name, or whatever. <laughs> whatever I can think of at the time. But um, I saw this, and I was like, oh, yes, perfect. So, again, it is 40 centimetres by 40 centimetres. beautiful picture of a gorgeous rottweiler there on the front in amongst some foliage it looks like some leaves and yes it looks just like my princess i'm telling you just like her it could be her actually so <laughs> couldn't it? it could be her i'm asking my daughter here. it just you know the same expression everything so yes and they are printed on both sides as well. I forgot to mention on the other bag as well. They're both double printed, both sides. And, um, yep, it's all stitched again. So, yes, these are perfect for, as I said, beach days, swimming pool days. Um, you know, shopping days, anything, really. Um... Yeah, and I will be washing them, as I said, about the last one to see how they hold up as well because I am curious about whether or not this colour will run. 
okay so there's that one and they're really good quality as well they're not they're not cheap you know they're, they're good quality and they should last me quite some time I'm hoping yes they will get plenty of use I'm telling you for sure so my next one is and they do different sizes as well so they do smaller bags as well than this but the ones that I chose were all 40 by 40 because I didn't want humongous ones I just wanted enough a big enough size for me to be able to get my nappies in not my nappies my daughter's nappies even her nappies are wet wipes food whatever you know just for me to grab when I'm on the run so to speak but this is just gorgeous the print on it is amazing look I'm gonna bring you up close now the attention to detail is really good here as well and again it's double-sided printed and you know I was thinking as well if you did want to spice it up with a bit of craft you could you could always put on a few little gems if you want a few little diamonds here and there to make it a bit sparkly you know um, you could use that B B5000 I think it is I can't remember the name of the glue the glue that I use and I told I tell you it makes those gems stick like concrete this you know gets bashed about and those gems have not come off um, the only thing is is putting it through the washing machine I think you'd have to hand wash it just to see how how it would hold out how uh, how it would hold up that glue but as I said this is just a full look I mean I do love the nativity anyway um, but yeah it's really got lovely detail on it so there's that one we've got the star up there the angels we've got baby Jesus and Our Lady so what was I saying so yeah the detail on this print is really really lovely and it's all stitched inside double stitch there I'm thinking if you did turn the bag inside out perhaps you know like how you do with colorful clothes you could put it in on a low wash that's what I would do I would turn it inside out before washing it and uh, like so and then I would just put it on a cool wash and I think they would hold up okay but don't quote me on it because I will test it to be sure I would also wash it with um, non-bio fairy tabs or whatever you know the one for delicate clothes just to be on the safe side because I think the bio the biological powder would fade the colour a bit so yeah beautiful I'm really pleased with these bags and my eldest just said to me you're going to get a lot of use out of these bags in this house I said I'm oh, nice so there we go I could stare at this image all day guys I really could it just brings so so much to my mind that I can't even express on camera well, I can't even express in words so anyway yeah so there's that beautiful bag whoops something's just gone flying there it wouldn't be a crazy borgy video if something didn't go flying I'm telling you and last but not least is Now, I bet you can't guess why I got this. Okay. Da 
ta-da it is a bird bag bird bag well it's got birds on it but it doesn't have my rio on it it doesn't but never mind it's still beautiful birds colors are amazing vibrant these are all my happy colors very mediterranean theme going on here with these colors i'm telling you yes it's bringing out the old latin vibes in me i'm telling you <laughs> so again it is double-sided beautiful bag and i think diamond grandma would love this one i well i know she would because i know what her taste is and it's very similar to mine and i know she loves color and she loves birds and I've just watched her YouTube channel actually where she was uh, unboxing um, I think it was a parrot diamond painting and she said that one of them were like Rio and I agree it was just like Rio there you go she knows her name in the background <laughs> but anyway again this is 40 by 40 centimeters exactly the same stitching as the other bags that I've shown you beautiful quality again I would fold it inside out and wash perhaps on a low heat once I've I've tested them I will show you how they look afterwards after I've given them a wash um, but yeah I'm really pleased with these so a huge huge thank you to Whisk I hope I pronounced the name of the company correctly for sending me these products to review I really appreciate it I'm now going to hop off and get the prices so that I can tell you how much they cost. Um, obviously, they were gifted to me for review, so I didn't pay for them. Um, it was in lieu of a YouTube video to help them. And uh, yes, I, I'm really over the moon and I hope to be purchasing some of these bags personally myself as well. So, um, as I said, I'm always looking for carrier bags, handy bags, whatever bag I can grab, basically. So, these are perfect. These are really perfect. So, if you hold on, I'm just going to go check my email so I can get the prices for you. Right. I've just had a look on their website. So, as of today, which is the 10th of August, 2022 just gonna line them all up for you guys so you can see them they are all the same price they were all listed on their website as the same price which was four pound 96 p each okay so i think personally that's a bit of a bargain because not being funny but how much do we spend on these plastic carrier bags and literally I've just bought before these came I just spent eight pound on biodegradable bags carrier bags um, for my recycling purposes and um, yeah which are really cheap really flimsy and you know I'm, I'm not going to get more than one use per bag out of them anyway these are heavy duty good quality beautiful pictures yeah i'm just really amazed at the quality actually so once again a huge thank you to wisp and hop on their website i'm going to link it all down below and i hope you have an enjoyable remainder of your day and uh, please take care of yourselves in in this heat it's very hot very humid and um, take care of yourselves and one another okay guys and i hope you've enjoyed this video it's something a little different i like to do little different videos from time to time and um, it's good to be different and not stay the same let's just say that so take care god bless and check them out i'm sure you'll be able to find one bag they do so many different designs so i'm sure you'll be able to find one bag that you will really like okay so take care, God bless, and I will speak to you all soon. Bye for now. Oh, and also one last thing. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and follow me on TikTok and Instagram, Crazy Borgies. And I will also let you know how 
one of these bags holds up after I've been swimming because I don't know which bag to take um, for the swimming pool but I'm definitely going to be taking one of them so maybe the Rottweiler one maybe because they're all my favourite things so <laughs> it's difficult to choose anyway take care God bless and I'll speak to you all soon bye for now bye